How's it going everyone? Today we are going to be checking out SS Sniper Wolf's content and we are going to be judging is her content good or not? Now, we are not going to look into her checkered past because that I think honestly is an absolute waste of time. We are just going to look at the now and what she is doing because believe it or not, SS Sniper Wolf is one of the biggest content creators on YouTube. Arguably, no, actually it's not arguable. She's literally the most successful React channel in the history of ever. She has ter almost 34 million subscribers, which is absolutely mind-blowingly huge. Okay, so that's the first thing. And I'm just going to slightly mention this. If you're an SS Sniper Wolf hater because of her past, I understand that. But I don't really care about it too much. And I don't want to hear anyone in the con uh, comment section call her ugly or anything like that, by the way. Because of the truth of the matter is, if you call her ugly, you're out of your mind. She is definitely good looking. And, a bit, and this is, by the way, I think a very, very important part of her success being exactly this type of good looking, okay? She is not your Kim Kardashian or Nicki Minaj, ice spicy, whatever type of, oh, look at my behind and watch me twerk type of things. No, no. S's Sniper Wolf, as strangely as this, has always managed to do one thing with her look. One, look pretty hot. Two, still look wholesome, not slutty. Which I think is an actual huge thing, considering after reading a little bit of the comment section right here, well, it's kind of easy to tell that most of her audience seemingly is very young people or women. She probably doesn't have a male, real male audience currently. All the people watching her content are women, pretty much, especially judging by the comments. These are actual real women commenting, which is mind-blowing on its own. And, again, I think her looks are a very big part of it, because she doesn't look like a mean person. She doesn't look like a mean-spirited person, which matters and is a th completely different thing to women. Uh, she doesn't look hateful, she doesn't look self-absorbed, she doesn't uh, look like that type of girl who's gonna say that she's better than everyone else, even though people who know her history know better than that. But still, but still, you cannot fault her on her looks because she's absolutely just winning in that direction. But anyway, let's check what kind of content actually she does. And spoiler alert, uh, she does TikTok reacts. Which I guess is reasonable because it's huge. Hello friends, it's me. And today we are checking out some funny parents on TikTok. Time to give her a taste of her own medicine. She's sleeping soundly. Yeah, you see, uh, right there, 10 seconds in. For men, yeah, most of us are probably gonna look at this and say, yeah, that's kind of cringe, I don't want to watch it. But for women... Women love this type of stuff, okay? If you're a woman, you can easily see, you're gonna you're gonna ask what was cringe about that? That was that was cute. <coughs> well, she's oh, laughing. Are you upset? Is she looking at him like not at what I sound like? No, she's supposed to be the baby. I'm gonna do this to my dogs. Next time they wanna bark me awake at five in the morning, I'm gonna wait till they're sound asleep. Pull up to their ear and just. <laughs> Tebow, come here. Well, she has a lot of editing, which is good, but I don't think that honestly matters. I'm on the phone with your new second grade teacher. They have to do it virtual, meet, meet your teacher. Say hi. That ain't a teacher. She's hot, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> my God. That's actually good. Way too young to be calling your teacher hot. Bro fell in love right there. He gonna be real disappointed when he shows up on the first day of school and it's not her. I'm trying the not hungry True. challenge on my grandma. <laughs> grandma, I'm not really hungry. <laughs> I'm not really hungry. You can't tell grandma you're That's not hungry. That's a funny voice. She made you a whole plate of food. Bro to your room you gonna hold on to it until you get hungry now you better take it back apologize give her a big old kiss on the hmm. forehead you know what sucks about growing up chances are everything nobody's ever gonna do this for you again so if grandma gonna bring your food to your room cherish it dad's choosing how to ask for a snack in the car Pass. okay well 
Currently seems everything's on point. You know, she's just kind of elevating the videos that she's seeing. Makes sense. Not Pass. bad. Pass. Smash. You know, the only snack my dad wanted was a cigarette. But I can tell you guys that I've grown up to be the dad who asks for the snacks. You know, I don't care who's in the car, I don't care what you're eating, I want to bite. $110? Dad realized you messed up. Oh, wait a second. You weren't supposed to get that Bruh. much. I would know I'm the Tooth Fairy. Is that actually 100? The Tooth Fairy got scammed. Bruh. <laughs> I think the Tooth Fairy was drinking last night. <laughs> That's a pretty good deal. $110. You know how much I got? One whole dollar. Teeth are expensive. Be I got nothing. I got told the tooth fairy ain't real the moment I wanted money. You're lucky you got something. These days. She's taking some boxes. Okay. I mean, Why it's a TikTok. together. But wait a second, you have to trust the process. So she's taping the boxes together. I hear children. Throwing in some markers. Oh, I see oh, children. and then you put the kids in there. Dude, kids nowadays are so trash, honestly. They're just low tier, you know? Man, it, if that happened to us as kids, like, we, we did stuff like this. We played with boxes. Those boxes didn't last five minutes. Alone? Let alone with anyone else. Like, uh, the, f the fact that these boxes are just not instant. What's the fun in a box if you're not trying to, uh, you know, get the other person to fall over? There's no fun in that. Cut them a little window so that they can talk to each other. It's a box of gremlins. You know, who needs a babysitter when you got a... The, vi the window is also kind of lame because, you know, you kind of want to push against it. Now you have a window, it's just kind of going to mess you up. Bruh, this is the worst thing ever. Just just throw the box at the kids and see what happens. It's going to be such a better result. A box of gremlins. They will literally sit inside these boxes and entertain themselves for hours, drawing on the walls. You know, you could draw all over the walls in here. Bedroom? No, no, no. This is actually a genius idea. Also, this would be so fun as a kid. Children just love to be in boxes. You know what I used to You're also not drawing on the walls. If there's a window, you're definitely trying to draw on another person. <laughs> Bruh, that Dude, that's, this is like the most horrifically wrong thing ever I have ever seen in my life. I used to do, I used to take one of these and then just slide down the stairs. My mom had True. to take off my wig for her snowman. <laughs> the snowman needs some hair. She's just gonna sit here, bald in the snow, while mother takes her photo. Even dad wants to pose with it. Like, oh, our daughter turned into a little snowman. We heard screaming. Bro, what are you supposed to do in a medic, honestly, nowadays? Uh, half the women are actually men, and half the half of those women are bald. It, it's like a minefield. So we came downstairs. You know what, son? Take the money. That and go wasn't deal with that funny, mother. though. I was really bribing his son, like. You know what? For a couple hundred, I would take the blame too. Like, yeah, dad, okay. Whatever you say. Growing up, my dad did this too. And you know anything but deal with the wrath of mother. Oh, she's... Okay, so... Uh, one thing she's doing, she's being very, very, very not authentic with these reactions. Yeah, she is just trying to play along with literally anything that she sees in the video. Okay. I mean, it's effective. But, yeah, this is, dude, this is definitely a killer for the female audience, isn't it? Like, like, the females are gobbly gooping this up like there's no tomorrow. Wow. Throwing things in my roommate until they figure out what it is. Part one. Where's your roommate? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice. No. What she realized? It's her. You know, technically, your child is your roommate. No. You know, technically. I don't think that little hand is gonna stop that table. Hey, Mom, do you have time to talk for a second? 
I'm just feeling really lonely lately. Like nobody likes me. <laughs> <laughs> I'll talk to my mom. Yeah. Wait, isn't that an old video, by the way? I'm trying to have a serious conversation here. My crunchy mom cares more about her acai smoothie. Like, nobody likes me. <laughs> like, oh, did you say something? It can wait. That's not gonna kill it, though. What are you the pussy back? What? <laughs> what? Is that a cockroach? Hey, what is that? A cucaracha? <laughs> I, I can't see. She doesn't care. Why is my dad holding hands with his foot? <laughs> oh, holding hands with your foot is one thing, but then caressing the big toe like that. I don't know, maybe he'd give himself a little. Go all the way, you know, you're already dead, so why not? A little toe massage. The dog Makes needs sense. some love too. You know, if my boyfriend doesn't hold toes with me under the dining since we have a 99.9% .9 fe male audience, bruh, I, I have a feeling this is the same, but you're just, you know, sitting at your computer and you just take your hand and, you know, you, you just have it in your pants. You're not even doing anything. It's just dead in your pants and it feels good. For no, it, because it just is dead. Some, something about that is just good. Understandable. I don't want him. I'm gonna just keep it 100 with you. Oh, you wanna keep it 100, huh? I'm like your grades. What, Darius? What first world problem are you gonna d about today, dude? Okay, I've had dude, that's good. Pod for years. It's broken, it's filled with dust, earwax. Disgusting. I know. Clean it? Like, I need the new AirPod Pros, please. You know, Darius, I've had jokes forever because of that. I'm broke and I want a new son. Oh, look, I have one, Jameson. So you can go find another mom and have her get you some dusty, musty, crusty new AirPods. Look at these! <laughs> Sorry, bro, you are no longer the favorite. You got the dog and a child in the background. And you want some new AirPods? Time to find a sugar mama. If she's pretty, her dad is bald. Hey, that that was authentic, probably. <laughs> Wasn't she a sugar mama forever for a guy? Bruh. Time to go bald. Why? Because all pretty girls have bald dads. No! Stay ugly. <laughs> <laughs> I just hit Smart. different when you hear it straight from your dad. You can stay ugly and I'm gonna keep my hair. And I guess I'm ugly because my dad got hair. Thanks to my oldest daughter. Thank you for doing the laundry. A whole hundred dollars for the laundry? Thanks to my youngest daughter. Thank you for washing the dishes. A my hundred? little child. You did seven chores out of eight. Here is a Carl's Jr. coupon. <laughs> Huh. Middle child gets no love. I don't know what it is. Wait, you have three children and they have each like, I don't know, eight tests. What the fuck? It's like the oldest was there the longest. They were the first. And then the youngest is like the shiny brand new toy. Like, oh, we have a middle child? I feel like sometimes parents forget they even got a middle child. Scaring Mexican dad. Oh, he got a magnet and he's gonna make a fork move under the table. Okay, this is actually terrifying. When's he gonna notice? Bro, look up. What the fork's jiggling. Oh. <laughs> okay. What's wrong? Scared of a little fork? You ain't ready for the real world. My brother's saying another one. Of okay, yeah. Every single person commenting was a woman for a reason. I, I can't. Like, you know, it's it's not. I, I don't think it's horrible. I, I think it's pretty okay-ish, but it's just the videos. The, the the videos are so women brain. These are the most women brain videos in the history of ever. I, I can't relate to them at all. It's like, it, it's barely funny. You know, the, the, the some moments are funny, but you know, most of them are kind of like meh. The mom's favorite line. Are you bored? <laughs> yes. Why don't you go clean your room then? <laughs> <laughs> Got him! I don't think she's ever gonna use that line again. Just, oh, you're bored? Why don't you go clean your room? Who cleans their room when they're bored? Not even Mother Makes wants sense. to do that. Hey, Mom. Yeah? I like your hair today. It looks pretty crisp and all. Can I touch it? Yeah. Can you touch it? Yeah. <laughs> 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 
I like your hair. Can I touch it? Oh, your mustache is real soft. You can't blame me. Scott told me to say uh. it. Now Scott in trouble. Hello? Hi, Mom. Uh. Guess what? Some laugh. I got partner on Twitch. Who is your partner? <laughs> <laughs> What do you mean? You got a partner now? A, a whole boyfriend? Girlfriend? That's not what that means. It's like I get a badge. Oh, a badge, yeah. Aren't you proud of me? Uh, yeah. No. Yeah. She got partnered on Twitch. <laughs> that yeah, yeah. Sure, sure, kiddo. Sure. Waste your life on shit. A little more excited. She acting like it's a bad thing. When I first told my parents I make videos on the internet, get out of my house right now. I'm like, not those videos. I asked my dad to not throw yeah, away my funny. straw, and he sent me this. Oh no, naughty naughty, he's going to throw it away. Ah, just kidding. <laughs> dad hmm. learned how to use the camera. Oh, you naughty naughty. Mom acts like her kid coming home from work. Oh my god, this looks so nasty, I'm not gonna lie. Like, ugh. The, the suburb- I, I hate America so much. Y you know this is America. You know someone this mentally deficient can only exist in America. Like, what is wrong with this? <laughs> is it gonna be a dog? Yeah, yeah it's throw dog. Throw everything on the floor. Dog is number one yeah. priority. <laughs> I hate life so much. <laughs> How are you gonna leave the fridge like that? You know, don't forget to stare at the fridge for a whole minute before realizing we ain't got nothing to eat. Mother, can we get McDonald's? <laughs> are these kids are so messy. No. <laughs> can we just no. skip? No. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> like a liar, kids are kind of funny. I caught them. Caught them hugging? Doing? Hello. Um, bruh. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, yeah, get uh, out of there. Run. Right. Oh, he snuck in a little kiss on the cheek. That's what dad was recording. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. I feel like some parents would have done way worse. Smart. You know, my household, you wouldn't have made it out the door. The cops would have been called. That's why I didn't bring anyone over. Bruh, he should probably beat this kid up. Look at that run. The cops would have been caught. L -l Look at that. Even if he's faking it for the TikTok, that that still requires a beating or five. Called. That's Disgusting. Why I didn't bring anyone over. How did it happen? <laughs> <laughs> at least he's gonna nice. laugh about it. Probably laughing because he knows he's not the one that's gonna clean it. Oh yeah, yeah. A huge mess in the kitchen. Hilarious. Daddy, what are you doing? On a rainy day? <laughs> okay. Well, I guess now they're gonna get extra water. Y'all got an entire rainforest in the backyard. Mommy, look. Okay, I think we're done. I, I honestly think we're done, yeah. I don't know. I don't agree with the TikToks. But this is, yeah, this is, this is literally, like, content for women 101. Like, Mr. Beast is content for children 101. Wow. Man, talk about hitting niches. Man. I, I need to make spooky stories because women love that stuff. Anyway, this is because said, said, I, I understand. She, she's just hitting the jackpot with women. That's all she's doing. There's... These are all real women who are posting these comments. Just stop and read them for a second. It's absolute be beyond insanity. Also, YouTube's doing a really good job absolutely recommending other her videos. Amazing. Anyway, this was Quizzer Said. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already and have a nice day. Bye-bye.